Alright everybody, welcome back to the channel. So for today's video, we're doing something kind of different, something I haven't really done before. It is Fortnite figures, but this is the smaller 3 and 3 quarter Jazzware solo mode line. Um, I got a bunch of these, a lot of them I found on clearance. Not these two, these two I bought full retail price. Um, mostly because they just made my brain happy. I mean, it's an axolotl and a sock monkey. I, I saw them and I was like, you know what? They trigger something in my head that says, yeah, need those. So I bought them. So let's start off taking a look at Axo, the axolotl here. For him being so small, he's got a good amount of detail on him. A little bit of smudge that might be from me playing with them because I've had this one for a couple months now probably we got the blue and red on the fins there nice little blue stripe going up the top the eyes are nicely punched in I like this little fade from the red up into the purple we got a jersey Looks like basketball shorts, maybe. Tennis shoes. You got a tail with a shirt tucked just enough to be able to move the tail. And even the tail's got this little black stripe, nice blue. Very well done. Especially for that size. Now let's take a look at Monks, the sock monkey here. This is the one, like, I saw her, and I was like, yep, she's coming home. It's a sock monkey, as a toy. I need one of these in six-inch figure form. So, come on, Hasbro. Let's, let's make that happen. Don't let that line die. Because I haven't seen any new announcement for the Victor Royale series recently. But So, she's got the little sock monkey tucked up top. Little stitching across the mouth cold dead sock monkey eyes little scarf you can see the stitching is actually painted here on the shoulders and here on the back of the head and then around there too and there's don't know if it's picking up on the camera but there's a subtle I don't know if it's a wash or just kind of a splotch but there's a little bit of white just kind of everywhere look like she's seen you know, some action been played with. White around the cuffs here. Sock monkey hands. And covered in texture. She's got a little tail. She's great. She made my brain do happy things, so. Now, for accessories, these are kind of more of a just cheaper line in general. So Axo comes with a harvesting tool. It's actually really well painted. Black, white, red. Looks great. It is a little bit thick for his hands. But you can get him holding on to it pretty well. And then Monks came with her harvesting tool, banana on a stick. Looks like a really good looking banana. Stick is just a brown stick. A little bit of green there to tie it on. And she does hold this really well too. Since I bought so many of these though, I've got just bags and bags of various weapons that I can, you know, give to them. So, show you some of those at the end. Let's go over articulation on good old Axel here. A little bit of up. No real down. Oh, there we go. Hinge just had to be popped. And 
cord's got your left and right rotation. Tiny bit of wiggle. Arm go. Super duper high. Rotate. Single elbow with the swivel, which I expect from a four inch line, so not a big deal there. Hinge and swivel. And then there is something going on in the torso. Get yourself a little bit of forward, a little bit of back. And then you can rotate there too. The shirt kind of gets in the way. But then I believe there's a waist twist as well. And the tail's on a ball joint, so you can get it up, down, pretty much all the way around, any way you want it to go. Legs go forward that high, back a little bit. out pretty much all the way got a thigh cut double knees and then ankle goes back and forward and you even got yourself some rocker on there too Take a look at monks here. Pretty much the same setup, just different build. So down a little bit, up a little bit, left and right. Tiny bit of wiggle there. Arm go that high, all the way around. Single elbow, get you ninety. And then rotates. All right. That's it. And there is a hinge and rotation at the wrist. Torso, you can see a little bit better here. Tiny bit forward, decent back. You can rotate there, and then you also got a waist cut. The tail, it's not on a ball joint, just on a peg, so you can spin it around. Legs go forward that far. Not really back. Out really good. And then you got your thigh swivel, and double knees, and you got ankles, which are very heavily detented. So, so yes, these are some of the most fun figures that I own. I absolutely love them. If you can find some of the. Uh, loot pinatas that they have for a good price i highly suggest picking them up because they'll give you like 50 accessories axel here ready for battle my youngest daughter loved monks when i brought her home so she chose this nice little gatling gun from my bag of accessories you get her holding it she looks great with it you get her balanced They've got to play with the ankles a little bit, but we'll get her there.
Sorry, that's taking a lot longer than I intended it to. Off camera, I had her in this pose in like three seconds and she was great. But yes, if you can find these for a good price or even these two for retail, I highly, highly suggest them. They are just a lot of fun. <laughs> thank you. And as always, thank you for watching. If you like the video, please click on that like button. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think about the uh, these 4-inch Jazzwares Fortnite figures. If you like them, hate them, wish they still made 6-inch, which I kind of do because they're... Legendary series was fantastic. Uh, subscribe if you haven't. And come back and see us again. Have a good night.